My youngest daughter and I have now set up the experiment to test the different water sources and water states in this growing system that we have put together. As you can see, there's 60 milliliter syringes. We will draw the different waters to feed into these color-coded trays. These are uh, seed starters. We'll be using uh, organic potting soil that contains the worm castings as well as bat guana and some other good things. There's the mung seeds. And we're going to be using tap water in its regular state as well as in a vortex spun and a magnetized spun water. We'll also be using Berkey water and we'll be using distilled water. Here's our distilled water. And here's our Berkey. And here's our Chloe. She's not part of the experiment. So we have this regular tornado tube. We have the magnetized tornado tube that has four opposing polarity magnets taped around a red version of the torpedo tube. And now we'll begin the experiment and we'll report our findings. All right, this is the tap water being magnetized and spun. Does work better to hold it in your hand, huh? Mm -hmm. One more. Yeah. All right. So that is the tap water with regular vortex. And now we're going to start feeding the plants. After we pour from these jars into their respective cups, which, as you can see, there's already tap water, Berkey water and distilled water. Shall we? Yep. Today's February 3rd, 2017, and I'm uh, looking at the plants after we have uh, basically shut down the experiment and have not really watered them in a couple of days. Not that I'm trying to kill them or anything, but uh, I am really very surprised when you look very closely at the plants that are wilted and dying. They are really the ones that were in the vortex. Either the magnetized vortex or just the standard vortex. They are not thriving. The Berkey continues to be very impressive. I think we're about to conclude this experiment.